time for the adventure of Sir Daniel Fortescue. Will he be able to save Galomir? Let us find out. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Void. I'm player one. I'm player two. And welcome back to Medi Evil. So as you saw last time, we went through the ghost ship. We didn't beat it. I went back and beat it. And it was all good. It was all nice and good. And who was right about the uh, crow's nest situation? You. Yes. So sometimes I am stupid. It does happen. Ah? Ah? What are you doing? Oh, brother. Alright, you're gonna have to... I, I can provide commentary, but you're gonna have to do this one by yourself. This it's chunky again. Yeah. Your damn... Middle Eastern internet. Question. Hmm. Could you possibly lower the FPS by like 20? Could I lower the FPS? Yes. Let me see. So people, it is a little better for him. We'll see how it goes. We're going into the entrance hall. I think this is his castle. We're, we're here. Oh no. We commandeered the ship. Oh, joy. Zarok conducts his evil wizardly duties here. Try not to disturb the imps during their routine cleaning duties. And please take off your shoes. Well, Hmm. Would you rather nasty boots or skeleton bones? Those mischievous imps have been at Xerox spell books again. <sighs> They're shielded by magic. The naughty creatures. Shielded by magic? I need a uh, magic weapon to break through. I would assume. I would assume, yes. You know what that means? <laughs> just use what, just keep using what Ben using. Yes, Feel, it feels like the magic weapons definitely are like the highest tiered weapons in the game. And we got like a little solar system thingy. One, two, three, you four. See, these are the uh, increasing. Five. These are the diagrams of the increasing size of my balls. Ball inflation? Wow, sir. No, that's that's I, just how big they grow over I, time. I, I heard. It's natural. I heard of your of your many many things, but ball inflation was not one of them. I don't yeah. like winding. They said the they said the imps were. Uh, we're going to be a problem dude with them being shielded by magic, but uh it looks like I no. see no problem we're already almost at the chalice. We got two very separate paths though, so I really wonder where it will be. Luckily we have full health, so we can just uh buffoon around. Ooh. What the hell is this? The Chamber of Secrets? Am I gonna find Tom Riddle? Oh, oh there's... Oh. There's the chalice. Magic sword stolen! No, 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 no. Give that back. Give that back. Spellbook. 
Contents, Raising the Dead, page 5. Putting a Town to Sleep, page 71. Looking Good for the Over 400s, page 136. Robbing People of Their Free Will, page 207. Summoning Demons, page 268. Card Tricks, page 298. Well, I think we found Zarok's uh, personal library. Give, oh, give me my sword back, you bitch! He's gone. We've lost the sword. Damn it. Uh, release souls? All lost souls released. Oh, that's where this starts. Uh-huh. What? You'll see. Know that if you release the entrapped souls in this chest, they will need help to be set to rest once again. Assisting these souls would earn one a place in Galamere history as perhaps the greatest of all its heroes. Is that something you would do, Sudan? If you do, history will be yours for the taking. Uh, so basically, these are new collectibles. They've appeared all in the previous levels. Ow. Oh, fuck off. You fucking bastard. Why are you so bulky? They're shielded by magic. I can't believe we lost the sword. Um, may you please open the inventory? Thank you. Well, at least I can still do that. Uh, give me... Give me this. And this. Okay. No. You bastard. Alright, well, it looks like just one more for the chalice. Uh, let's talk to our first lost soul. Biggest fish I've ever seen pulled me into the water. Right by the village lake. You should have seen it. I'm sure those fish are still in there. Okay. And so how these work is, you find them, they tell you something, and then you go to that level. So that sounds like the the village in the water level with the fish. Probably. Uh, yeah. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do all the Lost Souls in one episode. Just for convenience sake. You sure? The secret diary of Zerok. Ooh. One hundred years I've spent in exile, using my anger to keep me warm, feeding off my suffering, relaxing with my angst. But soon they will pay, all of them, including Fortescue. He thwarts my first plan to conquer Galamir, then posthumously claims to have killed me. When I find him, I'm going to get medieval on his bony behind. I never liked him anyway, always hanging around the court, interfering. Where are you going with that dead cat, Zerok? Where did you find that brain, Zerok? <laughs> Wretched busybody. <laughs> so, Dan has just always been a good guy. He's just... He's just a little bumble, you know? He, he bumbles. But he is good of heart. Oh, look, there's Eric in the uh, wall. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we need to kill one more thing to get the chalice. So, uh, yeah. And hopefully there's a shop so I can buy back the damn sword. I wonder if there's going to be a boss. Maybe? Oh, shop, 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 yes. shop. Okay. We have 1,300. How much will it be? Hmm. Guessing about 200. Damn. Well, damn. I guess we're not getting our sword back. Ah. Uh, at least I can get some of these. So I guess, I, I guess, yeah, yeah, just just no sword for right now. We're gonna have to 
get more money, huh? Well, luckily, I'll, I'll do the Lost Soul episode, you know, we'll go through all the levels again. We'll, we'll get money. It will work. All of them. Fucking imps, I hate imps, I hate them. Alright, go grab him, go back and grab the chalice real quick. Yes. I think that's already this level. I think this is a short level. Where's Zarok? Well, this is the entrance hall. So it's probably more castle levels. Yoink. And now we go. Yeah, hopefully we don't get to the last level in this episode, so I can actually do that Lost Soul episode, get money, and get the sword back. Because I feel like if we had to do the final boss without the good sword, uh, we will suffer. Okay, what is, what is this? What do you mean? It's a picture of... Picture of... Uh, <laughs> uh, Kuzgo from Emperor's New Groove? Look, that's his hat right there. It's a picture of your mouth! There it is, okay. Yeah, that's the end of the level. Um, Shortest level in the game, apart from Dan's Crypt. All right, please give me money. Money. We, do we get, uh, chalices from the other people? From the souls? Yeah, from the souls? No, you just have to get all of them and then you get one reward, but it's not from here. Hey, Danny man, how's that saw bearing up? I told you it was magic, right? I've got so much here I can give you, but I've no idea what it is. Do you fancy your chances, like? Uh. Helm. Well, I was already full up, sir, so thank you for that. Hey, I'd, uh, we'd like the sword back. We would very much like the sword back. Wait, how much money do we have? We need, like, basically a thousand. Ah. Wanna do Dan's Crypt real quick and I just farm the money there? It's not gonna be enough. It's really not. We could have just what? restarted the level. I didn't know the level was gonna be so short. We could have just restarted it. God damn it. Ah. Oh, there's a little mark on the level thing now. Saying if we've got the lost soul. Okay, okay. Yeah, this is still not the last level, so we're we're free to go. The you time. Said there's 21 levels, right? I think. I think this is right, the, so the, the penultimate one. There's 21. No, there's 21 chalices. So there's like yes, 20 21 chalices. levels. Because there's no chalice in Dance Crypt. Bruh. The time device. Oh, look at this. Pretty cool. Wow. Oh. Straight going Alice in Wonderland. Where well, we're going is the world of personas. Oh my god, we are. Train? This seems like a sizable level. Xerox seems to expand his reach beyond the confines of time. Just think of where he could go. Modern London? Egypt? The possibilities are endless. Oh, we're starting to get freaky at the end here, okay. You thought. You actually thought I would. Money. <laughs> oh, lever. 
Uh, okay. Gargoyle. Hello. Using a dark magic called science, oh. Zarok has constructed a device based around the mechanical measurement of time. The innards of this chronograph are fiendishly complicated. Keep your eye on the flying timepieces and get ready to reset the hands of the master time clock. Did you get any of that? As I can brains do. Uh, I think they just be they just be braining. Ew. Ew. You you jump on them. They're squishy. Ew. They got the uh, holders. Those aren't beholders. Those are eyes of Cthulhu. Little clock? No? Okay. I guess we're gonna have to set it to a certain time, but we don't know what yet. I wonder what would happen if you used the hammer on the brains. Well, since they're jump pads, probably can't, like, do anything to them. Yeah. Shock it. Shock it? Why are you performing electrotherapy? Okay. Where did you come from? Shot. Okay. Uh, I really just have no idea where to go at this moment. There's just a lot of paths. Oh, what the fuck is that thing? I right, shooting it. My buddy's not locking on. I don't think I can shoot it. No. Brad can just dash past. There we are. I mean, it was a little bit of extra stylizing. That looks like it'd be a tweet we anime. I can see it. I can see it. Right. Thank you for the Ooh. silver shield. Purple. Kill nice. it. Kill it. Quickly. So, these gates seem to be doing something with the time. I'm not sure what yet, but, uh, something. That's... That's a lot of eyes. Oh, purple. Okay, but what's over there? Uh... Okay, okay. Moon, top, yellow, bottom left. All right, moon straight up and then the uh, gold is on the three lines. Alrighty. What is this way? Well, uh, we got... That's a full... Is that a whole new one? I want that. I want that. Give me that. How... How do? I think we're gonna have to come back to it. Well, now the door should stay open at least. Ow! Bastard. Okay, guess what come- Ow! Fucking kill thing. It. Kill it, kill it, kill it. I miss her sword. I miss it too. 
Okay, and now we go. Got another one of these. Dash. Don't know why I didn't dash there, but uh, it's fine. Gotta, okay. <sighs> this is gonna be annoying, huh? Okay. All right. Moon over one. Got it. Well, you have to pull it all the way around, except for the last one. That doesn't make any sense word-wise, but... Just jump. So true. Oh. Is there something? No, that's just a clock thingy. Okay. What is this awful nightmare world? I don't know how this relates to time. Ah, you bastard. Oh. Ah. That was a cheap shot. What the hell? We're gonna have to go on up the other branching paths, huh? Two over there. We got some bozos right here. All right, we need red, and here's a book. This metal keep houses the magical chariot that Zerok calls his train. The path it runs along leads eventually to Zerok's lair. However, your route is blocked by gates controlled at various way stations. Travel to these on the train, open the gates, and head for the lair. Alright. Seems simple enough. Okay. Left or right? Uh, right. Okay. I really hate these things. Why? Do they just look weird, or...? They have very fast timing. Suck me up. Fuck me. Oh. Oh, hey, lost soul. It is I, Sir Sloane, the Dragon Smiter. You know how many dragons I've smote? Well, none yet, but we can change that to the dragon statues of Xerox Hall. There were dragon statues there? does it want me to do there? Oh wait, no, I, I understand, I understand. Mm. I think doing this will also shut down those and I can get the green. Yes. Huh. I think we should probably try and break the coils once they're off. Yeah, that's not enough time for anything, so... Must be something else to do. What is this? Oh, Chalice. Huh. Ooh, okay. We can... we can turn these. And that... and that disrupted the flow. Okay. As green. Do I dare? Little coward. <sighs> oh, I didn't. I didn't need. I didn't need to. That there's just a, a platform. That okay. Oh. Mm, it almost got my ass. 
Okay, let's uh, go back now. You think that disrupted the life file? Maybe. I hate ledges with no railings. That's part of the difficulty. Shit. Okay, well, we're already down. I'm just gonna go check. Yes, it did. Yes. Beautiful. Oh. That's probably the last, uh, big health. Oh, God damn it! Okay, put the yellow there, and then you do the big, 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 Nothing should stand in our way any longer. So, so each bar is 300. Uh, yes. So that's... I don't have the mental capacity to math right now. You do it. Okay. Eight bottles. Alright, so with the initial 300, uh, health we have, uh, and accounting for all eight bottles, we have 2,700 health. That, uh, that seems pretty good. I think that's about as much as some bosses have had. This seems like a nightmare. Just want to circumcise, yeah? How would I be circumcised? I have no foreskin. You see, that's where they have to get creative. Ew. Okay, I think we'll just walk in here. There's red. And now we go. Oh. You know, it's kind of a shame there's no way to kill these things. Yeah. If only we had, like, a magic sword. Yeah. Oh, someone in the... didn't let an imp I take tried it. to kill the imp. It didn't die. You saw me try to burn it. We need blue. We do have green, so we can do this. Thomas? Hello? Things are gonna come out of the walls at us. Really, really wish that those were just doors. Okay. Um, oh, I saw a thing you can move. Put it on the track and go. All right. Money <laughs> and some bastards. We haven't seen these guys since the town. They were only in the town, and now they're all around here. I hate the, the brains jiggle. The brains jiggle. Alright, yeah, there's blue. A shop. We still don't have enough. Ah, oh, goddammit. 
right, and then I think we just uh, go back. The level must be almost okay, over at this point. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. Yeah, I like that. Let's open that up and go. Oh, hello, boys. You big bitches. Almost have the chalice. Wait, the chalice was all the way back there. Yeah. God damn it. Also, how would you even get to it? It was encased in crystal. I'm assuming there's a way for us to free it. Which is which is the front of the train? Is it smiley face? Yeah. Did you think it was the back ass? Mm -hmm. I mean, they, they both have skulls. Both have faces on each end, so... And it can also go in reverse. Where? Where's the face on the back end? Face. What the hell was I looking at? The front. So, we, we, we know this. I'm stupid. Hello, gentlemen. Hello, gentle chuckle fox. Gentlemen. Okay, don't don't heal yet. What I save it for when you kill the other guys. And then come back and heal. All right, there's the chalice. I remember when the hammer was our most powerful weapon. Yeah. I would assume that is the exit. No. No, I, I think that's actually our way in. Well, we are both correct. Exit to the level. Entrance to the further reaches of castle. Okay. So I think we're about done. Now I just have to figure out how to get the damn chalice. There we go. Now we can get the most bang for our buck here. Dinky dinky. You know, like the why they put the skull on that part. So they didn't have to bother modeling everything. Yeah. I mean, it's got a lot of wires and junky in it. Okay. So that's before, the exit. Before we go forward, before we go forward, let's get that chalice. Yes, that is what I'm doing. It was that way. Yes. God damn it. You are awful at jumping those things. I think I may just be bad at platformers. Ash. And this is like a, a loose platformer, you know. Platforming is not the main focus of it, but it is a part of it. Okay. How? Pounced. Maybe some way to Okay. And Oh yeah. There we are. Okay. I was just bullshitting, but it was the solution. Let's go. Yoink. 
I would assume that's the second to last one. I don't know if the final level would have a chalice. Off we go into the wild blue yonder. Off we go. I tried to come up with something, but nothing rhymed with yonder. It doesn't have to rhyme. That's what makes it whimsical. All right, uh, there we go. That has to have been the smoothest a late game level has gone. Not that many um, fuck ups. Oh. You prove us all wrong. Maybe it is destined to be a hero. Maybe it can defeat Zarok. The people of Galamir may never know of your past mistakes, and you will indeed be remembered as the people's hero. Your time in exile is over. Welcome to your new home, Sir Daniel Fortescue. All, all chalices? Our own statue? Let's go! <laughs> Beautiful. What is, uh, what is our, our final reward? We go to, to Lady? Daniel, thank goodness you're still safe. I have a gift I can give to you, but sadly, I can't say how useful you will find it. Okay. Life bottle. Healthiest man alive. Or dead. King of Cups. Collect all the chalice rewards. Trophy level up. I didn't know that was a thing. That's... That sounds new. How do you level up your trophies? I think I leveled up my, my trophy? I... That's gotta be a PS5 thing. I have never seen that before. Oh, uh, but there we are. So, we got everything. Ah, uh, that's... That's all the chalice stuff. I think now it's only the final level, and then... Wait, how much gold do we have? Not enough. We still don't have enough. I want our magic sword back. We'll get it back. Do not worry. We have uno more level. I would assume. Xerox Lair. That sounds like final level to me. No chalice, okay. no soul. But so, what about the spooky castle over there? I guess that's just not a thing. Weird. Bullshit. No, we, we can't go here. This is the final level. There's no, like, alternate exits. Uh, but yeah, I think, uh, I think with that we'll end it there. I think we got two more episodes in us, dear boy. One to deal nice. with all the lost souls, and then one to finish the game. Oh man! Can't believe we've actually made it. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Um, yeah. I can play one. I can play her too. And we'll see you next time. Well, I'll see you next time. Where I go ahead and go get all the lost souls, because there are quite a few of them. All right. So you just want to make that the next episode? It will it will take a bit. It'll be like an hour. Trust me. There's one in each level. It, yeah, it's a, it's a whole thing. OK, I'll see you then. Bye bye. Bye.